Ooh, I can see inside of it, guys. Oh, come on, turn it around for us. You know what's in there? What? Welcome back to Dry Journey with Jeebus, guys, and we're back at the unit we picked up yesterday for $50. And I'm gonna be completely honest with you. There is no logical reason I bid on this storage unit other than I wanted to know what was in that wooden box. You wouldn't put that wooden box in there unless you have something really secure you're trying to keep in there. That's the only reason we bid on it. So let's hope our gamble pays off. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new. Let's get in the unit. So we're not gonna touch that until we get everything else out of the unit first because that's just, I don't, why do you store that? Who just puts that in there? there? There's gotta be something in there. There's a freaking logical reason behind that being in there. Let's pull some stuff out. Oop, first thing we got, what's that? My favorite, we'll send it over to Jeremy with the hails. Some fresh oatmeal rice cakes, yes. Is that for Reese? Oh, it's empty. Of course the one thing we like is empty. Um. You got one more thing in this bag, what is it? Hopefully it's just a cleaner. Come on, what do you got, what do we got? Ooh, it's honey. Honey. Just what we wanted, just what we wanted. But we do have a pan, so we do have a nice looking pan. Not too beat up or nothing, it's kind of beat up, but it's still usable. Keep the bag, I think we're gonna need it. I think we're gonna need that bag too. Let's start pulling some of this stuff off the top. Got a nice blanket, and as a lot of you guys pointed out in our last video, blankets and used towels, animal shelters take those, so that's donations, so that's always good to do with that stuff. I don't know about pillows now. We'll try that too. Because why not? I don't want to use they them. They serve as beds, right? Yeah, they do, exactly. Oh my gosh, I didn't see all that profit on the ground. Where? Did you see that? I did. Holy Somebody Jesus. during the auction pointed it out too. Money is leaking out of it. What if that's all full of money? Ooh. Let's get in this tote real quick. Ooh, it's heavy. Ooh. Let's see what we got going on here. Actually, come over here. All right. Cause guess what I got now? I'll just follow you. Uh, I got a nice cushiony seat. See, strategy. We're doing this smart. Let's see if it's in the tote. What do you think it is? Um, Ooh, gold. It's, it's not random. It's not clothes, I mean. It yeah, is okay. random. Let's see what we got. First things first, get, get, get out. We got a nice little pot here and whatever that thing is. What do you think that is? A pump. A pump, that's exactly what I was gonna say. How convenient. Ooh, people coming. Belkin charger bank thing, a power bank. What else do we have? Uh, that thingy. What's in here? Uh, Our some seat. of these are seats, yay. So it looks like a lift driver. I think this is the thing that goes on top of your car. It's that um, lift lamp. So that's like the thing the lift drivers and Uber drivers have. That's all paper. What is this? It's brand new. What is that? Let's take out the bubble wrap because we got it now. Is this a tire pump thing? Sure is. It's exactly what it is. It's an emergency tire pump. Plug it into your car and if you get a flat tire in the middle of the road, which has happened to us before, now you're safe. And they got two of these. So they probably give these to you as a lift driver because that'd be messed up if you get a lift ride and <laughs> break down on the highway. I'd be pretty mad. Uh, I think these might go to it. You think so? That's what uh, it looks like. It looks like we'll plug into your tire. I guess so. Maybe. We have one that looks like that with the seat, but it didn't come with one of those things. Yep, pictures. And we got these actually, that looks fairly new. Look at that. Mm -hmm. That don't even look like it's been used before. Nope. That's awesome. This one on the other hand's been used, but nothing dishwasher can't fix. Same with that one, it looks like it's been used maybe a couple times, not very often, still uh, the bottom's burnt, but again, usable, very usable. And same with this one, look at this. Nice little kitchen set. We also got even a couple plates. Ooh, a nice all block plate. So, nice stuff for our kitchen and a couple air pumps we could probably sell. So you know what? That's a good start in my book. What's up guys, hope you're having a great day. Haven't seen you guys in a while, I'm back. Let's go. All right. Ooh. I had a little bit of allergic reaction. That's why I haven't been on camera recently, but you know, it's gone. So right here, we have just an air mattress. Looks brand new though. I don't really know how dirty an air mattress can get because you put sheets on it before you lay on it, but. Hopefully. Looks brand new. Let's, let's have a little bit of weight to it too. Ooh. Another mystery tote. Yep. All right. 
we're gonna sit right here. All right. All right. Let's see what we got. You gotta guess first. What do you think? Yes. Mm, I think it's food. Oh no! I see that dirty stain there. <laughs> Let's hope not. Oh, oh, not food. Let's see what you got. All right. So right off the bat, I see little. These look like mini album covers. Maybe they were uh, an artist. They do. Yeah. Uh, here's a wallet. Oh, there's something in it. Nope, that's not something Aww. in it. It's just the cardboard and the wallet. Let's see my heart rate go up. I know. <laughs> um, we have more pumps in here. This is an AC adapter. We have another pump right here, 12 volt. Um, got a lot. We have another lock. Oh, yay. I'll Free lock. Take, take it all day. These. We collect these. As a store dog and buyer, I think you have to collect these. Yeah, you do. All right, so we have a screwdriver. Same. We have a black and decker vacuum. That works. That wow. works. That's unusual. Um, we have a Target bag. Ooh, what is that? A bunch of random stuff here. So we have, ooh, an old hey. fashioned alarm clock. It looks like every cartoon. We gotta test that when we get home for the recap. I know, I wish I could test it now. It just has on. We'll figure it out. Uh, it ticks. So it works. Oh, cool. We got to make it go like ah, the cartoon and just go crazy. Um, and besides wires, the only thing rattling around in here is this. Is this a fossil? Looks like some oh, wait, type it goes of Asian together. symbol. Hold on. Well, I can't get it together right now, but there's other pieces in here. We're trying to see what it says. These what look like, this? I don't know, decorative music notes. That would be my guess. Of some sort. More rocks. Oh boy. Like I haven't seen enough rocks oh, out of that one money. unit. Put that aside, put this aside. We have wood furniture and floor repair markers. It's kind of interesting. Right. Just color it in. Boom, bam, done. Um, oh, oh yes. here's food. We have garlic alfredo That's with aged favorite. parmesan cheese bertoli sauce okay all jokes aside that sounds so good um yeah it does uh let's see 20th of 20 it's still good oh sweet all right oh. 2k19 cover no it's gonna be in there hopefully it's in here and there's another alfredo sauce down there <laughs> let's get that out away here's a shoe one or is this the second one yeah that's a book bag which spring? This is Aldo. Not bad. Aldo. Not bad. Looks Jose like a Aldo. Door. <laughs> um, this is just a Hanes sweatshirt, but I don't know what that is. Yeah, like me that's neither. simple. Never seen that. All right, let's get into this book bag. Oh, what do we <sighs> see down there? Always, always, always. Now I'm scared to reach my hand. I would be too. All right, so this is a plastic magnetic key case. We might be able to use okay. that. It's kind of weird. Um, we have a Dell laptop charger. Ooh. So I'm gonna set that over here so we might find the laptop. Hopefully. Um, I know this goes in a car. You yeah. like the change thing in a car. Other than that, actually, let's check the front case. Nothing and nothing. That was a pretty boring backpack. <gasps> I see money, I think. Wait, what is this? Logitech, is this a speaker? It looks like it, doesn't it? Logitech Z313 speaker system. Cool. All right, and it has a little speakers right here. I might be able to use that too. There's a coin on the ground. There is a coin. What is that? It is a car wash token. Oh, boring. Car wash token, Fresno State shorts. They are Nike. Shirts. A notebook and a sock. Well, yeah, that, that's about it in this tub. Let me um, get on to the next stuff. So if you're looking at me sweating in here, it's hot, but you know what we got for you? Don't worry. We got one, two, three. Oh, falling. Yeah. Oh, no. It's Four, five. Fun. Okay, I'm gonna throw them out. Yeah, just look over there. A whole hidden mountain of water bottles. For what reason, I have no idea, but they're there. So I see this weird Sony thing on the ground here, and I'm kind of hoping, I don't know why, for some odd reason, that it's actually the lift thing. We missed a water bottle. <laughs> no. Water bottle. No. A speaker. It's a speaker system. It looks like only for Apple, though. You plug your little 
Apple product up in there, and boom, you got a bumping system. That's kind of cool, actually. And I guess bumping system. This man just said bumping system. Shh, don't tell nobody I said that. <laughs> well, I guess this is another piece of it, but the big profits here. Ooh, look at that quarter. Look at that quarter. That's money right there. Let's get this out of here and see what else we got back there. We also got this big picture in the corner of, I think that's Madonna, right? Yeah, I think so. I think so, too. Think you know what? I might be. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Just saying. But nice picture. What else have we got going in here? A box. We got flat. That's boring. Yeah, it's ripped on one side. Uh, yeah. That would be worth thousand dollars, Joe. Junk. I oh. guarantee you, at least one person is gonna say in the comments, "You just disrespected that guy's stuff." It's a freaking ripped box. Let's see what else we got. You want this? No blanket. We can wash that. Another blanket. Mm. Oh, they just donated to the animal shelter. Oh, true. What is this? A baby thing. A baby backpack thing. You put your baby in it. On you. I always see people do that. I feel like I walk like this. Come on, let's go. Sorry, right, baby. <laughs> just walk like this down the street. I feel like that'd be kind of weird. Guys, I just found something that's going to make way more than a unit, I think. Check this out. Boom. The Beats Pill XL. XL. Ooh. I know Beats is kind of like some. Ooh. 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 What ew. did you do to it? Oh. Well, I still think somebody would buy it if it works. I know Beats is kind of like Apple. It doesn't really have to actually be better quality. It's just that people see that name and logo, they're like, here, take my money. <laughs> I don't know why, but we got that. Let's see what else we can find behind that box. All right, let's see what else we got behind here. We got a pillow. Exciting. A toss, piece of trash. Um, this looks like a blanket. Again, Ooh. donation. Just what we wanted. Here's a shoe box. Uh -oh. oh, we just lost uh -oh. our light. Ah, oh. I think it's motion Technical sensor. difficulties. We have light again. All right, back to the unit. <laughs> so we have a hood for a jacket in an empty shoe box. Ooh, two of my favorite things. Man, I'm gonna leave that to put trash. This right here, I think catches that? mouse, don't it? The mice? Yeah, I think that stays in the unit. Oh, okay. I'm pretty sure. I'll put it over here. Another one. Why does this man need so many water bottles? All right, so we have there's something in here. In the trash bag. I'm scared. But it feels soft. Uh oh. No. Um, Alright, so we got dirty socks and we have dirty underwear. Well, I feel outside of the bag. And a dirty shirt <coughs> that smells like okay, horrible. Let's okay. not do that. That can go in there and that can go away. Um, let's see. This is. Just a happy Father's Day. It's pretty unique. That's kind of cool. Hand prints. Now, is that the picture of when haters always tell me I should stop making videos? This oh, one? Oh, there it is, yeah. No, I love you more. That's what they're thinking. I thought it just said no. <laughs> no, no. And bears. <laughs> All right. Only a few more things back here. So let's see what we got. Another water bottle. So we have. What is this? Alright, so this is just pillowcases and wire. This right here is just a herd of elephants. It's kind of cool, actually. No markings on the back, though. No markings anywhere. It's a light. So, I mean, I don't know how much something like that's worth. Maybe $5? Looks cool. Here is another music note. And then this thing. What is that? Right here. I saw that and I thought it was a bowling ball. I home. Oh, it's a speaker. There's another speaker. Wow, I'll turn so, it on. That's the front of it, I guess. Yeah, look, I home. It's a big sphere Why speaker. Why do I feel like there? I should be able to open it? Maybe Bluetooth. Depends how new it is. It has no power. All right, All so right. besides this and the little particle board thing here, which we got to get into in a second. Be right back. Now that we clear everything else out of the unit, let's try to get this thing out. What is this? Ooh, I can see inside of it, guys. Oh, come on, turn I it around for us. You know what's in there? What? An ad. No, 
I'm just joking. Probably not, but it's empty. Okay. But it's, I don't really know what it is. A handmade something. We can like, you know what would be kind of cool? What? Just put like a cat bed in there. A <laughs> cat bed. I'm if, just trying to think of a use for it. Yeah, I know. If our cats actually laid in beds, I think that'd be a good idea, but they don't. So... They lay where they want. We got this thing. So, yeah. I don't know what it is, really, but what it's meant to be, what its original purpose was, but that it's there. That's what we paid 50 bucks for, <laughs> to know what that was. Curiosity, satisfied. All right, guys, let's do a recap on this pretty epic $50 storage unit. Even though the whole reason we bought it was to the box and there was nothing in it, we still ended up with some pretty sweet finds. So where should we start? Should I start on this side? That's no, up. I'm starting on this side. Okay. So <laughs> something that, I don't know if you touched on this in the video. The matches? No. All right, Not so this enough. is an Embark um, air mattress. Sorry, <laughs> brain fart. But I found a few pumps in there, so I'm assuming these kind of pumps can pop up anything. And Dexter's at the door. Hi, Dexter. Uh, if it's the double wide one, which it looks like it is, it's like I don't know, an extra foot off the ground or something like that. They sell new for forty. So this one looks brand new. So I think I can get at least twenty from this. Easy. Um, and then this backpack right here, I don't, I don't know. It just looked like I might be able to resell it, but I don't know what this brand is. Mm -mm. It just has like a, a U type thing on it, but it's a it's a Ooh. denim book bag. Um, and I mean, like I said, the shape's not bad, mm -mm. but I need you guys to help me out with that logo. Please. Um, next, these things. So I'm just gonna. This bag was partially ripped anyway, so I'm just gonna take it out. But. It looked like it went to the pumps. Yeah, it looks like it goes to the, no, it looked like. But the pumps come with their wires, but it's a little can, and it says on there that there's like a eight bar and a maximum PSI, and then this is on the bottom. And it says something replace tire without delay. So I don't, I don't know what these hmm. little canisters are, and I didn't know how to look them up either, but we have two of them. I think it's like an Insta pump. So That's like, I, don't, like, I don't know. I don't know if it's an up, instant pump fills your or. Tire up. <laughs> yeah, I, I have no idea. So you guys help me out with that one. But they're new. Yeah, both brand new. All right, so we got Sony speaker systems here. Let's go. This one, the Logitech one here, is the cheapest one of the bunch. It's only like sells for like 15 bucks, but it has that piece and then the two mini speakers right there to go with it. And like but, a little controller. And, and a controller. <laughs> I didn't even know that. I might have made it different. No, actually, I looked that up by my phone number. But that one's only about 15 bucks. This one, this is sold on eBay for over $300 or close to $300. But they've also sold for as low as like $150. So with the paint on the bottom of ours, I think ours are close to Closer to the 150. Yeah, I tried to clean it too. I don't know how to get the paint because it's like within the holes on the speaker and I have no idea how to get it out. I don't Plus, know. I don't know if it's like spray paint or something. So, I mean, within the little holes right here could be damaged too. So, I have Just no idea. I don't understand idea. why. Who in their right mind would take like a $300, probably new, I bet you it's even more than that. Of course. Probably $400 Beats Pill speaker and decide it was a bright idea to put paint on it. I'm hoping they had kids and the kid did this by accident, but if that was an adult that did this, they are not very bright, no. to say the least. Not at all. This one, surprisingly, was worth more than I thought, too. This is about a $45 speaker, too. This is a Sony. Is this the Sony one? Yeah. Sony for your iPhone or whatever. You put your little phone right there and go, and it just sits there in place. So this is about a $40 speaker. Just in speakers, we got, I mean, over $150, probably yeah. closer to $200. Because this one, you got to talk about this one. But I'll say it's worth about 50 bucks. It's $100 new, and people sell them used for between 45 and 60 So we'll say 50 bucks on that. I was but, looking for an outlet. <laughs> There's no outlet directly behind this. Aww. But I did plug this up. This right here lights up, and also the top. But just, I, just when it said iHome, I thought it was only for iPhone stuff, but it's not. It's just a Bluetooth that hooks up to anything. iHome just the brand. Uh, yeah. But it does completely, it yeah, it does work. I haven't tried it's to hook it up cool. to Bluetooth, though. I think we should keep this I might one. keep it. Yeah, that one's pretty cool. I like dancing and stuff. It makes you feel like you're having a disco party <laughs> in the living room. So we kept this little thing because I'm sure somebody will buy it anyway. But I don't know if it's like a handmade piece that's actually worth more than we're thinking. I was just thinking something cheap, like 3 to $5 at the flea market. Yeah. But... Sometimes those wood things end up being handmade and they end up being worth like $30 to $50. So definitely put it aside because 
We don't know. And I don't know if wooden handmade stuff is marked by whoever made it. Yeah, I don't know. There's I nothing don't see on any that. Markings yeah, on that. I don't see nothing either. So these, to my surprise, the American-made ones, which these are, are worth about 20 bucks. These have a little thing to plug into your car, and then you can pump your tire on the road if you get flat in the middle of the highway or the middle of the country. Trust me, we drove from Virginia to California. There's a lot of areas where you won't find a gas station for 50 miles. So if you get a flat tire, you're going to need something like this, which is pretty cool. And they're 20 a piece, and there's two of them. This one was in the bubble wrap, as you saw in the video. We just took it out just to make sure it had all the wires with it. Two brand new. That's about $40 right there. This thing, it ticks, but I'm so sad that we couldn't figure out how to make it go. I don't know. There's, like, there's nothing on the back. The only thing on the back is the on-off switch and the two buttons to adjust the hour and minute hand. That's it. There's nothing anywhere else on the clock. But the brand is West Clocks. Don't know what it's really worth. I would guess like $5 or something. But I just I really kept it because I was hoping I could have a cartoon moment and to make me go off in the morning like and just wake everybody up in the house. It was for comedic purposes. But we still got it. It's cool. So overall, 50 bucks spent. We probably got about, shoot, good amount of stuff. $250 or so, and luckily the big box is just, uh, I'm mad it was empty, but at the end of the day, it caught my attention enough to buy the unit, and the unit will end up making us some good money, so I guess that's a good thing. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video, so if you did enjoy it, make sure you leave it a big fat thumbs up, and if you're not already, hit that subscribe button for awesome treasure hunting videos all the time. If you do want to follow us on our social media links, they're going to be on screen. Click the links down in the description below, and make sure you follow us on whatever you have. Thank you so much for watching, until next time. Peace out.